Welcome back and thanks for joining us. This is Holly Shields reporting for Calkine Media. Let's talk petrochemicals. Petrochemicals are the synthetic compounds which are derived directly or indirectly from hydrocarbons present in crude oil and natural gas. Petroleum is a complex mixture which is found and trained in subsurface rocks by the decomposition of fossils. It may contain one or more carbon atoms into which the hydrogen atoms are attached. This journey of transformation from raw crude or gas to the user-centric petrochemical product involves various complex steps. As per EIA in 2019, the US has used around 27% of its total petroleum consumption as a petroleum product. The global petrochemical market was predicted to be around 476.2 billion US dollars in 2020 and is expected to reach 651 billion by 2027, showing a compound annual growth rate of 5%. The Asia-Pacific market has dominated, having around half of the whole world's total market share. The demand for petroleum products is rising due to a rise in demand from end use of industries and capacity in addition to base chemical industry. BASFSE, British Petroleum, PIC, Chevron Corporation, China National Petroleum Corporation, China Petrochemical Corporation are some of the key players operating in the petrochemical industry. Due to COVID-19 pandemic, the imposition of lockdown and travel and restriction all over the world has hampered the petrochemical industry too. The demand and supply both have declined due to less consumption and end of the industries are limited in demand from the travel sector. After the extraction of crude oil and natural gas from the subsurface, which comes under upstream process, the raw material is transported to the refineries where it is refined and converted into various usable forms. Various fractions of distills are obtained, which include diesel, heating oil, waxes, feedstocks, lubricating oil, and asphalt, etc. As per EIA, a 42-gallon US barrel of crude oil yields around 45 gallons of petroleum products as a result of the work process gain that is caused due to the refining process. The volume increases because of the density of some final petroleum products which decrease during the due to various types of chemical treatments. This has been Holly Shields for Calkine Media. Thanks for watching.